celebrate the wildlife that Utah has to offer. Joining us now to preview the International Sportsman's Expo in this sponsored interview is artist Chris Peterson. Thank you for being on the show. Thank you for having me. So this big event kicks off in Sandy at the Mountain America Expo Center tomorrow. It runs through Sunday. Tell us your part in the event. So I'm going to be at the youth fair part of the expo. The youth fair is bigger and better than ever uh, this year. In addition to the trout pond and a live education raptor climbing wall and um, gemstone panning and a whole bunch of games, Wildlife Walls is going to be there doing some art activities and wildlife storytelling activities. Okay, that sounds like the most fun. I might have to stop by. You should. Okay, so if you've never been to the Sportsman's Expo, what else can you expect? I mean, there's anything outdoors at the Sportsman's Expo for hunting, fishing, outdoor lovers, um, anything that you want to see there. Anything you want to see outside, you can go there and there will be representatives, companies, organizations there getting you excited to get outside once spring comes, which I think it's almost it's here, It's almost right? here. I mean, we're dealing with the rain this week, but it's so nice to go inside then and see what you can do yeah. over the weekend. I love, though, that this is for families. I mean, this truly is something to bring your kids to. That's right. We, we are accepting all ages folks to come participate with us, but the youth area is really popular with the, with the young kids. Like what ages? I mean, if it, all ages, really. The, the work that we're going to be doing to, re, to promote a contest that we're launching starts with four and up, but younger kids can come and, and participate as well. Well, look, everybody can get involved. I'm going to have to swing by and bring my boys. They would love this. Okay, you have a little art project to tell us about, and yeah, we might so, even try it. So in the fall, we did an event where we celebrated the Bonneville Cutthroat Trout at the Neighborhood Hive in Sugar House, and we had kids paint these little cutout trouts as they were learning and it was a really popular activity so we're bringing it to the expo. We're going to have um, people learning about the Colorado River cutthroat trout, another variety of native fish in Utah and as we're kind of talking to them about that we're going to let them participate right, in this decorating is for Dina, so now so we're participating in this okay, right pass now. It over. So we'll are we just peek. taking We have these amazing liberty? Posca pens. The kids are crazy for these. I am too, actually. They're what are these? What awesome. are these pens? They're paint pens. Oh. When, you, when you use them, you'll see. I'll see how, how it goes on. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. So should we follow along with so this you model can do whatever or just you, do as what you, we want? We hold no, that up so we know what no we're... There's no wrong answer, but this uh, is what it these should. are some samples. Oh, nice. What it should look like, Dina, when you are done creating. Okay. I've got it. I'm ready. You got it? Okay, right, so you just needed right that here. glance and All that's right. it? That's it. Right here so I've got it now. Reference. All right, let's talk about what else happens on the weekend. Harvey, the story bus, yes. tell me more. So this is cool. We, uh, I've teamed up with the Utah Wildlife Federation on the Utah Wildlife Walls Project, and we just launched a $10,000 cash prize contest for Utah wildlife-inspired art, writing, photography, video, music, digital art, and digital storytelling. $10,000 is a big deal. It's a lot of money. It's a lot yeah. of money. And kids, teens, and adults all have their own categories, so you're competing against folks that are mostly your own age and uh, up 21 $250 first prizes. Oh, I was just going to ask what they win, yeah. what, they, what they're walking away with. They're walking and then dozens more cash prizes. The winners, the highlights from the show will go into a traveling exhibit that will accompany the state, or accompany these murals that we're looking to paint across the state. The, this Utah Wildlife Walls project is really about painting 29 murals across the state, one in each county. And are you part of that? I am. I'm, I'm a muralist. And yes. So that's part I've, I've teamed up with the Wildlife Federation to make that happen. What's your favorite part about getting the kids involved, both with wildlife, with the arts, everything that the weekend, weekend entails? I mean, the only thing that kids love more than, than paint is animals. Mm -hmm. um, and putting them together just really breeds a lot of excitement with young people. I mean, with you guys too, look how great you are. I know, I'm trying to be focused. I feel like we're whilst, taking this very seriously. That's, whilst that's being, cute. So you took the black, so I my my fish has purple dots. That, Should we show our progress no so far? Answers. There's no yeah. wrong way to there's do no this? Wrong okay. Way. Could any of us be part of your mural painting Please. after? Oh, Dina, that's actually looks really <laughs> good. It looks like an eel. 
Big no. a little bit. No, that's great. No? No, well, no. Okay, did, there's my little guy with awesome. the purple dots. Yours dog. is really cute. All right, let's talk about tickets. If they're still available. You can get them at the yeah, door. Get them but at the go door. and bring your kids, bring your family. It's the International Sportsman Expo. It's ha Look how cool that mural is, Dina. Yeah, I did that oh, one. Did you do that? Did like that it's eating too. the window? Okay, those are oh, beautiful. Oh, I love it. Mountain oh, America too. Expo Center, March 16th through the 19th. Sportsexpos.com for more information in this sponsored interview. And you can go to abc4.com slash GTU for more and celebrate Utah Wild life.org huge contest happening there so make sure you go and check it out thank you for being you. on the show this we was appreciate fun. this yeah. was fun i mean you and i are i'm more, still working more creative you than need i a thought a little more time but yeah. a little more time to start we're back with more gtu after this <laughs>